Good Samaritan Society residents took a plunge hundreds of feet below the interstate today. They got a tour of the Knife River Quarry. Tonight, Kelloland Sarah McDonald takes you along for the ride. Over billions of millions of years. Residents were in for a bumpy ride as they made their way into the quarry today in Sioux Falls. They ended up at this staging area in the South Hole, which is about 280 feet below the interstate. Well, it's quite an adventure. I've never been in a, this big a hole before. And to learn the history of the area and the city. In this particular tour, we uh, brought the bus down to a safe staging area where you can uh, look, overlook the view of the operations as they were uh, happening. Uh, we are a uh, active mine and operating, and we'll make sure everyone's safe. Drive down a little bit further, and now you're 320 feet deep. President of Knife River, South Dakota, Clark Meyer, says they've been giving tours of the quarry for over 20 years. People drive by on the interstate or on, uh, on Madison uh, and wonder what's at the bottom of the hole, and we think it's important that one, they get to find out what's at the bottom of the hole, but also educating them on why it's important to the community, uh, what all the reserves and resources here are used for, and how they impact the community or, and end up being part of building the community. He says this part of the mine began work in the 1980s. Residents may realize the memory this trip digs up. Well, some of the residents probably saw the mining beginning uh, way at the surface level. And so to see it now developed and at the depth it is, uh, is, is very entertaining for them. You don't realize the immensity of it. So it, as I said, a unique experience. In Sioux Falls, Sarah McDonald, Kelloland News. Quartzite is the main product being mined in the quarry. It's used for ready mix concrete, asphalt, pipe bedding, and other base material for construction.